Hello and welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about caracal sheep. Uh, I believe all of them in here are ewes and there are a few uh, lambs interspersed. Caracals are a really cool breed. They're from uh, Central Asia originally, although they, they're all over the, the world now. Predominantly they are, uh, well they have a huge range of colors, uh, black being the uh, most common, but they have grays, whites, browns, um, and, and whatnot. They are both polled and horned, and then there's a few that have uh, skurs, which are little uh, horn knobs. They have a pretty long fleece. If you let it grow for an entire year, it can go. It can range from anywhere to six to twelve inches, depending on the genetics. They're considered a, a fat tail breed. And later on, I'll, I'll share these sheep, and then I'll, I'll show some pictures of their fat tails so you can get a better idea of, of what I'm talking about. But they're a really, really great breed for homesteaders and, uh, and even just production-oriented uh, uh, people. They, they have The males range from 175 up to 225 pounds and the uh, ewes or the females are around 100 to 150 pounds at maturity. They're out of season breeders so you can breed uh, the, the lamb every eight months if you let them and they normally have singles and they but they'll also have twins as well. Uh, tri triplets really aren't aren't that uh, common or, or expected. They're really good uh, mothers. They lamb very easily because of their long, narrow head, and so they they rarely have birthing issues. And they're a, a really good, really easy keeper. They're parasite resistant, and so that helps for for most flock owners. And overall, they're they're pretty good sheep. They're very docile, um, not really aggressive. And I, I recommend these for uh, homesteaders and for basically anyone that uh, wants an unusual sheep. They're pretty rare in the United States. Uh, but all in all, a, a, really, a really good sheep. I think I'll get some fo footage of uh, some rams so you can see what, what they look like. They have really good uh, hooves. They very rarely have ho hoof rot or other hoof issues. And they do flock pretty easily. Although they don't do well with herding dogs because they, uh, um, they will scatter. So uh, that's about it.